Oh, we're on fire. I can say, what's that burning noise? Uh, it's my ass. <laughs> Scorp. Oh, wait, did I take the meat? I don't want the meat. Yeah. Their venom's worth taking, but not the meat. Alright, we're still in danger from you. Okay. Don't know about that. Okay, we still have danger. Just don't know where from. Oh shit! Oh! Fuck! We just got irradiated, or not irradiated, diseased. Those damn uh, Yauk Wise are just terrifying, man. All right, what is this disease we just got? Uh, stats, effects, fog eyes, minus 25% crit chance, and minus two perception. Eh. I mean, that sucks, but it's not really bad. Wait, I have an immuno booster, don't I? Huzzah, I got two. All right, fuck you, fog eyes. Go away, and don't come back any other day. Alright, didn't we kill one or two down here, too? Uh, is that all of them? I guess we'll take the Yao Guai meat. So they were all... They were all coming from up here. They have like a hideout or something up here. Oh, yeah. There's oh shit, there's more. Caution. Where does this stairway go? Nowhere. It's go time. Not for you, it isn't. There's land. Oh, there's landmines down there. No surprise. Okay, let's go see if there's anything 
useful in this house and be mindful of landmines. You've discovered Charnel House. Don't mind if I do. Ah, 308s. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. I bet you that Watts is worth something, plus it's got a mod on it, too. Oh, yeah, 374 caps. You betcha. We'll take it. All right. Let's do a, a quick save. And... I saw fragments on this side of the place. Kind of hard to spot, though. Is that a motorcycle handlebar or handbrake? Yeah. Those are actually quite valuable for their VW. All right, there's a mine right there. really look closely you know it might actually be easier when it comes to the mines to take this off because you can kind of see the the little red glowing light on them well that's assuming it's facing towards you though See, I didn't see that one at all. Okay. Yeah, maybe not such a good idea. Uh, let's take all these expired stim packs, and we're going to need to splint our arm and our leg. Yeah, that hurt. Did not see that one at all. Okay. Uh, we should probably just get out of here before I step on another one. See, I didn't see that one either. All right. Fuck this. Get out of here. <laughs> Oh, damn it, Jim. Okay, let's move on. That was a bit of a painful sidestep there. We should be just about there. Let's take a look at the map. Yeah, getting close. In fact, that's probably... Uh, is that it right there? Seems to me like it should be a little further away than this. Is that another mine? It is. All right. All right, let's uh let's kind of steer give that place a wide berth. See a pretty good sized rad scorp up there. And he's uh right where we need to go. So we're gonna have to take him out.
Oh, there's a... Is that a Talon? I think it is, because I don't think Raiders carry backpacks, but Talons do. Hmm. Okay, so now the problem we have is if we shoot that Scorpion, we're going to get his attention. I'd rather have the Scorpion sneak up on us than the Talon. Um, let's do this. Let's get up here. Oh my god, there's two Scorps up here. Big mothers, too. And a bot over there. Okay, let's move away from the scorpions and get back up over here and see if we can take the talon out from up this way. Alright, we need to get a better vantage point here. Uh, I don't know. That guy looks like he's got a motorcycle helmet on. I don't want to... I don't want to kill another innocent. That does not look like a bad guy. That doesn't mean he isn't. But what are they doing in a place that's surrounded by landmines if they're not Nefarious. Maybe they. Maybe they were. Maybe they're being held prisoner there. Yeah. See, when I put my crosshair over over him, it doesn't turn red. So that is, that is not hos a uh, hostile. But I am curious as to who it is and what their deal is. So let's see if we can get in and talk to them. I don't see any landmines over here, but that doesn't mean there aren't any. Right, there's one right there. These might be his landmines. Maybe this is where he's holed up. Oh. Oh, he's just a scavenger. Hey. Hey. Dude. Yeah? You realize uh, I almost took your head off. But I didn't. Take a look. Welcome to... Godforsaken hellhole. Not much to look at, but it's all mine. You do realize <laughs> there are a bunch of landmines in your front yard, right? If you want people to come and trade with you, you might want to remove those. I'm just oh, 308s, we'll take them. Just saying. Do you he doesn't have a doctor's bag. Ooh, I'll take your purified water. Uh sure, we'll take a weapon repair a repair kit for twenty. We'll take a duct tape. Uh, normally I would take a wrench, but not now. Alright, I'm going to sell him this kind of off ammo that we don't really use or need. I mean, I, have, I already have a bunch of that stuff back at the base anyways. We do use microfusion cells for making pulse, shotgun pulse rounds. Uh, you can have the Alkwai meat. 
And I will sell you this. He's not going to have enough coin for this, is he? Nope, he's not. Okay. We could... <clears throat> Alright, if we buy all of this ammo from him... That gives him 184 caps. And then maybe what we could do is sell this back to him. That leaves him with four caps. Okay, cool. Give me a shout if you need anything else. All right. Um, I would really actually like you to get the landmines out of your yard if you want me to come back here and trade with you. I was tapping the button. <laughs> it didn't pick it up. All right. Fuck that. Enough screwing around with landmines. I am not, obviously not on my A game tonight when it comes to landmines. Okay. All right. Let's get moving here. Just about to our destination. And we're going to still have to kill these scorpions, but let's just kill them. We'll take the poison glance. Let's go. Oh, what's shooting at me? Ah, fuck. Unable to continue. You fucker. Wasn't something shooting at me from up there, too? Oh. Well, that's a muty. Oh, shit. Hostile. Target identified. Please clear the area. Let the scorpion Until fight him. Has been restored. I want the XP. Okay, talk about everything attacking you all at the same time. Goodness gracious. Um, let's take one bandage just to top off the health there. Okay, we looted you. Uh, where'd that super go? We were over, uh... Another mutant that way. I wonder if that's our bounties, the mutants. Because that's right where we got to go. There he is. Uh, that. I'll pick up the laser rifle for now. I saw another super walking around over here. There he is. Do I still have a problem? I thought I fixed that. What the hell, man? I'm using up all of our splints. Okay.
my guess is that the mutants are fighting the raiders that we're supposed to take out. Yep, that's exactly what was happening. Soften them up for us. That's a talent. Yeah, he's got a talent emblem. I wonder, though, is... Is that who we're actually after for the bounties? All right. I think what I want to do is get up on that ridge and come at him from that direction so we have a little more cover. Hopefully we don't run into a Yagwai up here. Oh, we crashed. Okay, I it wasn't too long ago that I saved. So I'll meet you guys back up on this ridge. All right, let's see if we can figure out what the deal is here. See some Brahmin down there. We should be looking right at the shack, but it's probably hit behind some trees or something. I don't see that Talon Merc. All right, somebody's shooting at some somebody or something. Yeah, my vantage point's not all that great because. Look at that place. That's like a a gopher head with a mining light on. Huh. All right, well, we're going to have to go down because I can't see anything from up here. That's our destination. All right, there's a talon. There's another Talon with a flamethrower. Oh, shit. Get down. Get down! Can't see a damn thing. We're on fire. Shit. I can say, what's that burning noise? Uh, it's my ass. <laughs> okay, let's do... Let's do a combat ultra stim. And a blood pack.
All right, where is this motherfucker at? Are we, uh... Yeah, we've got a bummed up to arm too. That was some heavy firepower, man. Uh, I wonder if that was actually our own... Oh, we're still in danger. I wonder if that was our own frag that actually blew up. He's down. We're still in danger. My pulse slugs are quite advanced. How's that, eh? You like that? Pretty advanced, isn't it? And thanks for the scrap electronics, too. Alright, now we have a caution. Take all of that and we'll leave the armor. Didn't we have... Yeah, right here. I was going to say, there should be another dude. You have discovered makeshift shack. Why do I get the feeling like it's super mutants that we're going to have to kill when we go in there? I don't know, but is our... Um, can say is our our super uh, super stem whatever thing still active but it's not all right here we go talon the company boss crippled um oh no I think I just shot up all my pulse slugs. Okay, well, they do damage too, I guess. We, uh, we need to repair this thing. I just realized that. Let's do it. 
Okay. Talon Company boss. Laser rifle with mods. And there's the finger of the fugitive. Nice. Now let's loot the shit out of this place. How's our weight? We just hit max weight. Uh, oh, it's got a fat man. Of course it does. Good lord, look at all this ammo in here. Oh my god. Oh, oh. Wow. Wowzers. Okay. A five five six millimeter pistol. Interesting. Um I am definitely gonna have to come back here. There's just there's no way I can grab all this stuff. I mean missiles and nukes. Just one of those nukes is worth two hundred and fifty caps. Okay. Ah, uh, let's see. That laser rifle's worth 103 caps. That one's worth 281, plus it's got mods on it. The mercenary carbine. It's worth 141. That we want to take back with us. This 32 pistol isn't worth anything. We can get rid of that. And we haven't picked up any armor. actually drink some water we need to um i'll take the mire alert cakes okay so let's grab the 308s nice and the 44s yes we have three pounds left we're definitely gonna have to come back for the missiles and the and the fat boys. Or mini nukes, rather. Let's grab the two stem packs. That's quite the weapons cache, man. Grab uh, those. Is the pulse grenades? Those are probably, yeah, they just put us over. There, it's right at 358. Okay. So, oh, we're still encumbered? Yeah, I guess we need to be at 357. What I'm going to do is... There, uh, God damn it. Really? Those must be like a half a pound each. Just put them all in there. There. Okay. Um, I am going to... Hoof all, hoof all this stuff back home, just like I did before. Um, I might... I don't know if I'm going to go back to Evergreen Mills. I mean, there is a lot of stuff there, but at some point we got to, you know, we can't take everything all the time. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take a load back to the garage. Then I will meet you guys up at our headquarters. Wherever the hell that's at, right here, for the turn in, and then I'm um, trying to think: is there any place over here that's got a gopher hole? Because that's just a lot of walking around. I don't know if there is. 
But anyway, that's that's my problem, not your guys's, because of course I'm not gonna show that on camera. So yeah, I'm gonna take this this first load back. Then I'll meet you up at the headquarters for the turn in. And then I'll then we'll then we'll probably end the episode and then I'll probably just haul the rest of this stuff back off camera in between episodes. That is a really nice ammo cache though. Okay, so yeah, I'll see you guys at the regulator headquarters. Alright guys, we're back at the base. Um I got everything put away, got repaired. Uh we ourselves are in pretty good shape. I took some rat away. Our well, our limbs aren't in the best of shape, actually. Um, so we're going to sleep because we have a level. So let's do that first. And then maybe we'll go visit the dock in the morning before we head over to headquarters to turn in um, our our bounties. I've got a whole bunch of fingers. So we're going to make a bunch of caps just on that alone. Okay. Let's continue pumping explosives and guns. <clears throat> well, so we'll get that to 50. And let's get guns to 70. Now, I think what I'm going to do here is I'm going to take... Uh, there's, there's two possibilities here. We could take intense training, which will allow us to uh, give ourselves another strength point so we meet the requirements for our beloved machine gun. Or there's another one here that cuts the weight of heavy weapons in half. I'm trying to remember which one that is. Heavyweight. Okay, weapons heavier than 10 pounds now weigh half as much for you. Modified weapons that drop below 10 pounds will not gain this benefit. <clears throat> so our machine gun is 12 or 13 pounds, I think. The thing is, though, is we still technically wouldn't meet um, the strength requirement. Whereas if we just give ourselves a point in strength, then we would be able to carry more as well as handle the weapon more properly. Adamantium skeleton. Your limbs only receive 50% of the damage. Ooh, that's a good one. That's really good. Um, during combat, while not sneaking and using handgun, you gain twenty percent draw speed. Is there okay? Uh, let's see. Yeah, a couple of these are new here. Fifty percent damage melee and unarmed. Center of mass, straight to the midsection and down the go on vats. No, we don't do vats. Yeah, I I really like this one. We're gonna take another rank in this one at some point. But I think just giving ourselves another point in strength is going to be beneficial in more ways than one. So let's go back to where which one was it? intense training. Yeah, let's take that. And then we're going to give ourselves a, another point in strength. And now we meet the requirements for Ambassador of Peace. <clears throat> Reach level 14 with a good karma. Look at us. So now, um, oh, actually I put it away because I wanted to go light while I go get the rest of that stuff. But let's just pull this back out for a minute. It is the mercenaries machine gun, I think. Yeah, this one here. Okay. <clears throat> we don't. Don't really appear to be more steady with it than we were before. But we do We do meet the strength requirement now. And because we have another point in strength, we can also carry more weight now too. Okay. Yeah, I don't at least in terms of weapon sway. I don't really see a difference than from than before. Hmm. Yeah, not sure. Maybe it all. Uh, I thought that was the main thing that it affected, but maybe it also affects the things like weapon spread and whatnot too. Anyway, let's put that away. We're just going to take our sniper and our uh, shoddy with us for now, uh, because again, I want to run light because we. I still have all that shit way back 
at that shack to pick up and haul back here, which of course I will do off camera. Uh, all right, so let's go get fixed up at the dock and then uh, go to the headquarters. And I think in the interest of time, I'm just going to take the transport system there. Mutants looking at you. I already traded with Please. Wolfgang because he w so went close. by the house uh, when I got back, so... Oh, you know what? I have morning. some morning. Uh, I have some dirty water that I wanted to bring over here too, because um, I I paid him to to You'd do the water. Have cancer. Okay, seventy-five caps. Here. Now, how did that get in there? Oh, I keep forgetting. I can't just turn around and leave while he's fixing us up. All right. Do you have any I, doctor's bags? Not quite. Man, I can't find any doctor's bags anywhere. Okay. Try. So now we should be in tip-top condition. I'm definitely taking that adamantium skeleton one, though. We need, we're slightly thirsty and hungry, but that's okay. All right, I will meet you guys over at the HQ, and we'll turn in our bounties. Okay, we are at the HQ here. Incidentally, I have um, 6,090 caps. And I'm not done. I was still got all that stuff to haul back uh, from the shack. And if I want to, I can go back to Evergreen and haul all that stuff back too. Okay. The unrighteous will be punished. Right, okay, where's Sonora? Now, does this have... Yeah, we were going to check that to see if, if it gives us the ammo. The regulators welcome you back. Then you've been busy. Good. Show me what you have. So many of the unjust have been dispatched, but so many remain. But ever still, word reaches me that you have gone far beyond what we've asked. Thank you very much. Good deeds should not go unrewarded, and so I will add on a bonus to your normal bounty. Okay, and how much is that? Ooh, wow, 920 caps for <laughs> 92 figures. That's awesome. Okay. Lucrative Regulate. business bounty hunting. Regulate. Okay, so that takes care of you the finger turning. Now, if we go here and we go to select reward ammo... Um, and do uh, 308 caliber. Let that setting thing finish. Um, and then collect the bounty. Congratulations, regulator. You've done an excellent job in performing your duties. Blah, 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 blah. Collect the bounty and enjoy your reputation gain. Okay. Uh, okay, and then log off session. You should talk to Sonora. Okay, we got a hundred bottle caps, and did it put ammo in here? You it did. Nice. Okay, so that is how that works. Doesn't give us a ton, you but hey, talk to Sonora. that's cool. Okay, so that's how that works. Then you tell it you want what ammo you want, and it'll Good put it in the you box again, for brother. you. Fan freaking fantastic. Uh, I think we deserve a new Coca Cola Quantum for that. All right, guys, uh, I'm going to let you go here, and I'm going to go back and haul all of that stuff uh, back home from the makeshift shack. And if I'm really feeling like working my ass off, I might go back down to Evergreen Mills and grab some of that stuff we left down there, too. And uh, so we are currently sitting at 7,110 caps. At some point fairly soon here, I'm going to start buying some of those extra add-ons for the house. Now that we, you know, have this much money. And, but the plan for the next episode. Oh, you know what? We need to take another bounty. I want to always have a bounty. Acquire a wanted contract. Glad I remembered to do that before I left. Okay. Uh, is that all I got to do? Yeah, we do. Okay, cool. You should talk to Sonora. A raider camp. Okay, so that will get us um, 
that'll get us as far north as we've gone. I'd like to eventually explore the entire north and the entire, you know, western section of the map. We've already pretty much, I mean, we haven't been to every single possible place in the north, in the southeast. But, um, yeah, just to kind of do some more exploring. So I think what we'll do in the next episode is we'll we'll probably go hit this raider camp and then just do some random exploring up in the north and if time allows you know we've got several pois over here that we can check too but anyway that is it for this episode hope you guys enjoyed and if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel leave a comment share the video and we'll catch y'all in the next episode Bye bye